Okay, what we're going to do first is label these points. First, we have point A, B, and C. And to find the perimeter, what we're going to have to do is find the distances between these. So first, we have to find the distance of A, B. And to do that, we're going to do, we're going to use the distance formula, the square root of, you know, x2 minus x1 quantity squared plus y2 minus y1 quantity squared. Plug this information in. I want to change the brush size here. It's going to be square root of, uh, let's do x2 minus x1, so that will be uh, 3 minus 0 squared plus 0 minus 0 squared. So that's going to be square root of 3 squared plus 0 squared, which is square root of 9, which is 3. So that's the distance between A and B. Now I want to find the distance between B and C, so we do the same thing. So let's assume this is x1, y1, and this is x2, y2. So that's going to be 3 minus 3 squared plus 4 minus 0 squared. So that's going to be the square root of 0 squared plus 4 squared, which is going to be the square root of 16, which is 4. Lastly, we'll do C and A. This will be our x1, y1. This will be our x2, y2. So distance of AC will be the square root of 3 minus 0 squared plus 4 minus 0 squared. And that's going to be the square root of 3 squared plus 4 squared, square root of 9 plus 16, square root of 25, which is 5. So then the perimeter of ABC, tri sorry, triangle ABC, is going to be 3 plus 4 plus 5, which is going to be 7 plus 5, which is 12.